Hello, I'm going to show you guys how to do all the multiple steps in this cupcake. This is step number one. You can choose a tracer. We're going to put a paper on top of it and we're going to trace it with markers. Or you can choose to draw your own cupcake over here without a tracer. It is your choice. So I'm going to put my paper on top. We can see the lines through it. We're going to trace our little cupcake. If you want to add more to this, you could add more to this if I wanted to draw like a spoon or something. Little tiny spoon to help us eat that icing. Alright, now we are going to go on to stage two. Uh, you have two options here. If you want to use crayons and texture plates, you can. Here are texture plates. What you're going to do is you're going to slide the texture plate underneath where you're going to draw. You're going to take the crayons that you have peeled and right here I'm going to take the crayon sideways and rub it on. And now I can see that really cool dot you can change up your colors if you want to. You don't have to keep them all the same. And then I can change it to a different texture plate. Can color my spoon. So that is how we use the crayons and the texture plates. If you want to, you can combine this with the next step. The other way we can add color is to watercolor paint. So I have my water bucket, I have my paints, and if you want to, you can also watercolor paint on top of the crayons if you want to. You have two choices for step two. All right. For step three, you're going to choose a piece of construction paper. You're going to choose a pre cut little cute tablecloth. And I've got these little doilies. I'm going to go right here. All right. Open up the glue. It's okay, you can cut it out right away. There we go. Our beautiful little painted cupcake is done. Happy creating!